Hi all, I'm Frantic uh, and the goal for today is to open this box of 2012-2013 uh, Penny Limited Hockey box. Uh, there should be like uh, 7 cards inside the box, uh, not much of course, like for uh, for $100 uh, dollars product, but uh, at the same time like it depends where what do you compare it to like uh, I guess seven is like uh, uh, more than the number of the games that Rick Di Pietro played last season so so it's not that that few after all so let's, let's get started with this book Okay, and here we go. Okay, how do we? Yeah, I guess it looks this way. Yeah, so here, here we have the pack. Let's try to to open it now. kind of tricky okay and so here comes the first card it's Oleg Goligoski stars uh, number 78 out of 299 yet like 299 is definitely too much for for a stars player card because i think like stars is a uh, is one of the least popular teams of the league if not the most if not the least popular so it's uh, i don't know where like 299 copies of this card like will go okay and and here's the second card it's Oh, this is limited travels, Sam and Verlamov. Yeah, so it's like uh, two two color patches. Yeah, this avalanche patch is also like two color, dark, uh, uh, like purple and and blue. It's just not a very clear. It's my my camera is kind of cheap, and so it's numbered. Uh, 20 out of 49 yeah it's a uh, kind of a nice nice idea but uh, uh, but unfortunately consistently with the uh, with the name of the set uh, playing time of Vernamov is very limited I guess uh, I think like Jigger is nowadays considering the starter in Colorado but uh, I'm not sure actually Okay, and the third card, and it's a uh, uh, Rocky Redemption, uh, Boston Bruins. Uh, I don't have any sense like of who it could be. Like, uh, I guess the only Rocky in Boston this season is Dougie Hamilton. Yes, it's probably him. Okay, and uh, and redemption again. Like, <laughs> are you kidding me? Like two redemption cards in a in the pack of seven, in the pack of seven. Just uh, what is the idea of like uh, issuing a product if you if you can't put anything inside? And so this is like, oh, Akimelio. Uh, yeah, it's. Uh, yeah, it's a uh, first ever Nigerian hockey player. Uh, so he played uh, like two games for Calgary uh, last season, if I remember correctly. And so now I think he's bouncing back and forth between uh, between ECHL and AHL. So uh, uh, not very promising. Not very promising. Uh, you might uh, wonder how 
how do I know him? Like it's uh, simply because I pulled his rocky cards from certified this season. So I I checked. Uh, so it's uh, checked who he was. Yeah, so really painful. I don't know, like uh, financially opening this uh, Panini product, it's like, uh, I don't know, signing Scott Gomez to, uh, to seven years, 7.5 million per year contract, like, uh, and here comes uh, Jordan Eberle authentic Jumbo material, yeah, and numbered uh, 66 out of Oh, no, it's uh, 88 out of 99. Uh, yeah, it's a great, great success pulling such a card. Yeah, I mean, it's a great success pulling such a card from uh, from a one dollar bin at a show, but uh, pulling, uh, pulling it from a one hundred dollar box, it's, uh, I don't know, it's kind of a disaster. And here we we have uh, board member board members G. R. Runic numbered one ninety seven out of one ninety nine. Uh, well, it's a uh, it's a transparent card, but it uh, it looks really cheap, like uh, like I don't know, like the roster of Columbus Blue Jacket. And the last card uh, is Zach Paris, uh, numbered one out of five. Yo, I don't know, is it uh, some kind of parallel? At least based on the based on the number, it should be like. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. It uh, it doesn't look like glossy, glossy or anything, anything like that. Yeah, no. But at least it's like a low, low numbered card. Yeah. Well. Uh, yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a disappointing. Uh, a bit of a disappointing box. It's only this volume of like uh, card. I think is is okay, but. Uh, but otherwise it's kind of kind of losing yeah but uh, let's hope for uh, for a better luck next time see you guys